How you doing? You need some help? Ooh. Nice tattoo. I like chicks with tattoos. Those markings are this. Uh, is that Indian? Seems to me like I've seen that before somewhere. It was on my mother's chest. What? You watched a knife go through it. Oh, yeah. You that little squaws, Brad, aren't you? I thought you were dead. Butch, Red, 
Go get her, boys. Why don't you try slapping me? where you came from. Wait a minute! Me go back? You're the one that better go back! Barnes landed here about an hour ago. He'll probably head for his place up on the old Halyendi spread. The locals have been called off. They brought in three professional killers. How'd you find me? <laughs> Your dad used to bring you up here. Look, if I found you, you know that the men that Thorne hired to kill you are gonna find you too. Let them. Wait a minute, will you? Listen to me. Come back to my cabin. You'll be safe there. The search party's already looked. They're not going to come back. Besides, I can get some food into you. Honey? That little Raya. She's here to see you. <laughs> Not much left of her, is there? Not much left of anything around here since they built that damn place. You saw the land, nothing's growing right. What does it do? <laughs> it's supposed to get rid of toxic waste. What you're looking at is a goddamn political landmine. Nobody wanted it. But the feds and the EPA don't have any jurisdiction on Indian land. Thorne and his cronies stood to make millions if they could push it through. They had to get approval of the tribal council. No way was your dad going to go for that. This is why they murdered him and your mom. If you knew, why didn't you help me? You had no proof. There's nothing we could do. It was the word of four white, upstanding citizens against one strange little Indian girl. You never stood a chance. You don't know how powerful these people are. They got enough money behind them to buy all the law they need. People wouldn't get off their land, fine, bang, they disappear. And why didn't you stand up and fight? We were scared, that's why. You wanna end up like you do. End up like me? Look at yourself. You're the one that lives in a prison. Look at your wife.
I'd rather fight and die with dignity than live like you. It's been fun. They found her. She did. It's only a matter of time.
Larson. Like pissing me off. Larson. That's what you answer me, god damn it. So Thorne is not playing games, sir. So one of you assholes open up his mouth and respond. Thorne. You're no good piece of garbage. Listening to me.
If it wasn't for me, it'd be another ignorant Indian squatting in a mud hut. Because of me, you're not. Some problems down at the plant, Thorn. Just some uh, minor matters. That's pretty irrelevant. I think the prospects of nuclear radiation spilling into the Colorado River, the water supply for the Western United States, to be quite relevant. Obviously, so did Walter Arroyo. That's why you had him killed. I wouldn't do that. I'm getting my checkbook. What's it going to take to make you go away? An ambulance. With you in the back of it. Look, what's your name? Dell, isn't it? Isn't it Dell? Dell. Let me explain the facts of life to you, Delbert. The people that I'm in business with have enormous influence. Do you understand what it means? If you play cop with me, I'll get off. And you'll get nothing. I just heard you confess to murder. That's the word of you and a psychopath against mine. And as my lawyer would say, you'd never get me to admit it before judge and jury. You've got a point there, Phil. Thank you. If I was to take you in, you'd probably be free on bail within an hour. And you'd probably beat the charges within a year. That's ironic, isn't it? Yeah, but what's really ironic? Is that if I put this unregistered 25 on your desk and you grabbed for it, then I could shoot you in self-defense. Justice would be served. But I'd have to be stupid enough to grab it. Because if I don't, and you shoot me, that would be murder in the first degree. Yeah. Like your lawyer said, you'd never get me to admit that before a judge and jury. <laughs> <laughs> 